Hey guys, welcome to the Lunchtime Review. Today I'm going to try this uh, Simply Asian Thai Chicken Hot and Sour Rice Noodle Soup Bowl. Uh, that's what it looks like, at least on the picture. Yeah. It is um, 130 calories for half the bowl, so it's uh, 260 calories total. Um, sodium double that, so it's 8, 960. Uh, sodium, that's really high on sodium. And most Asian meals are really high on sodium. I think it's weird. Um, so we're going to peel back the lid to open the bowl halfway. Remove seasoning vegetables and oil packets from bowl. Empty contents of packets into bowl. So we're going to remove the packets and put them in the bowl. Um, pour one and a half cups of water into the bowl. Fill in bowl to the lower top ridge and then cover with the lid. Mark one half for three minutes or until water is hot. Let it sit for a minute or two. Let it soften. And you can also do it with boiling water if you want to. Not that I have that ready. So let me see if I can open this. Okay, it's in, um, it's in a plastic wrap. So I'm going to have to... I'll be right back. Let me get all this stuff out. Okay, this plastic outer wrap, there's no way I could have gotten that out with one hand. I almost didn't get it off with two hands. Um, so anyway, I pull the lid back halfway and you can see there's the packets. There's the oil and the whatever. And there's the noodles. It looks interesting. So I'm basically going to take these, I'm going to open these up, put them in here and fill the water up to the, let's say the um, lower top ridge. So I'm assuming that is right here. Right there. So that's where I'm going to put it. I'm going to put it right where that line is, right there. So, uh, so anyway, I'm going to pour this in here, and then I'll come back and let you see what it looks like with all the water and everything in there. Okay, right, after everything's poured in and the water's in there, this is what it looks like. It doesn't say to stir. It doesn't say to put it in there and stir. It says literally fill it with water, cover with lid, and microwave for three minutes. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to do anything with it. I'm just going to put it in there and, and let it go. So I'll be back when it comes out. Okay, here it is on the microwave. I haven't even stirred it yet. So um, I'd also notice that this is a vegan meal as well. So if you're vegan, you can eat this if it's any good. It looks okay. It smells okay. It doesn't really have a, well, it doesn't have a strong smell one way or the other. Um, I don't know what sweet and, or I don't know what hot and sour is. Um, I would almost think it would have a, sour, I always think in food, I always think sour is either um, a lemony, flavor or a, a vinegary flavor and uh, hot I would think spicy so, so I don't know I love these noodles I think they're cool they're like translucent definitely not like a spaghetti noodle those are like a, a rice noodle probably what they are rice noodle soup yep so anyway I'm gonna let this cool off for just another few minutes and I'll be back okay it's said time to cool off so here's the bottom I'm gonna take it's got some some green in there so I don't know I notice also on the box, it has a citrus, like lemon or lime. I think it has lime and a pepper on it. So I don't know if that means anything, but um, here we go. Those noodles are a little chewier than I would have expected. They're, um, Almost not quite as bad, but almost like little rubber bands. I mean, they're 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 kind of tough. Um, not bad. I mean, it's nothing you can't chew, but it is something you have to chew. Um, you couldn't gum this to death. Let me try by this one has like a it looks like a rind or something, a citrus rind maybe. A little I don't know what it is. It looks I don't know. I don't know what it is. I'm not getting um whatever they consider sour. I'm not getting that. I'm also not really getting the um, the hot. Honestly, um, I mean there might be a touch of spice to it, but it's nothing like wow that's hot. You know, it's just I don't know. It's not hot spicy like burn my mouth um, spicy. So it's it's weird. I don't know what the sour is either. It really doesn't have a lot of flavor one way or the other.
I mean, I can taste the noodles, and I can taste a little bit of the broth, but it's really, it's really bland. I hate to say that. It really doesn't have a lot to it. Um, to have almost a thousand milligrams of sodium, that's pretty much all it's got going for it. It really doesn't have. I, I personally do not taste it very strongly. Um, it's not a bad meal. Let's put it that way. Um, I'm gonna give it a two because it's some. It's just not the exciting. The flavors just aren't exciting enough to, or good enough to really justify me getting it again. Um, it's definitely worth eating if you like um, Asian noodles meals and you're vegan and you want to try it out. Definitely try it out because you might taste it and go, oh, that tastes wonderful. Me personally, I don't know. Maybe my taste buds are dead. I don't know what the deal is, but I just don't get anything out of it. So, so anyway, I hope that helps and uh, thanks for watching.